Hello YouTube, this is going to be my review of Taco Bell's $1 beef burrito. Uh, I find it interesting because I know what they used to call a beef burrito, and this ain't it. Uh, if I can open this up for you, let you see that rice. It, it, it's got tons and tons and tons of rice. Uh, There's, if you can, there's, there's a little bit of beef in there. Uh, that would distinguish it from the uh, the cheesy bean and rice burrito. Uh, but so I'm a little skeptical. But it, it, it look at that. It, it, it's nice and, and fairly good size. I mean, so for a dollar, you're getting a good bit of food. Uh, let's take a bite out of it and see what it tastes like. I gotta tell you, I think it tastes it tastes better than I expected. Looking at it, it didn't look like it would be that appealing. I don't, like I said, I don't know what kind of I'm not sure what kind of beef this is. It, it almost tastes like barbacoa, frankly. Um, really has a good taste to it, uh, but I haven't gotten into the I, don't think I haven't gotten into the rice yet a whole lot. Well, I've definitely eaten some. Take another bite. Hmm. Good. Um, there's some kind of looks like some kind of sauce in here. No, tortilla. Uh, I wouldn't want to hazard a guess as to what kind of sauce it is, but uh, it looks cheesy. It, ta it tastes kind of cheesy, uh, but I don't think it's the cheesy sauce from the, the cheesy bean and rice burrito. But uh, Actually, this thing is tasty. I mean, it, it frankly tastes a lot better than I thought it would. And for a dollar, I really like it. Uh, I really do. Uh, it was kind of surprising that for a dollar you would uh, you would get something that, you know, this tasty. Uh, but it, it's, it's nice size and uh, a very good taste. I'm, I'm going to give it my... Uh, my approval. I have another bite here. There's maybe a little chipotle taste to the sauce, but I don't think it's the chipotle sauce, but it could be. And that the meat, for whatever reason, kind of... I don't know. I really hate to hazard a guess as to what it is, but uh, I like it. I, I, I really like it. Like I say, I can uh, picture myself gaining a lot of weight here. Uh, I want to mention that. And a lot of people are worried about the health consequences of eating something like this. Now, I'm, okay, technically I'm a doctor, but I'm not that kind of doctor, and I'm certainly not your doctor. Uh, I, I feel that if you uh, maintain a healthy lifestyle, if you're exercising and, and whatnot, that uh, things uh, like this probably don't hurt you at all. You know, if they make you overweight like I am, uh, but... You know, right now I am exercising. Uh, I'm building up. I did a mile and a half today. So uh, I'm trying to build up to four miles. And then I'll worry about getting the intensity up and the uh, time down. Right now I'm just worried about the uh, getting the, the 
you know, get in the distance and then I'll worry about the, uh, the time. And uh, right now I'm just starting out. So actually uh, I've had a heart attack. So what I understand when you first start trying to build up your, your uh, heart, you're more at risk actually than you, than, you, than you are liable to get a benefit. So you need to start slow. And again, that's not medical advice. I'm not telling you what to do. I'm not going to be liable if you uh, have a heart attack. But uh, I think it'd, it'd be all right to eat like this. Uh, I've known people that eat nothing but junk food and they're skinny as a rail. And I've known people that eat uh, pretty healthy and they're quite obese. But anyway, the, the, this thing is good. Take one more bite before I let you go. And uh, take one more bite. I'm getting more into the rice. Getting more into the rice. Not quite as tasty. So let's get another bite because this one looks like it's going to have a lot of rice in it. Okay, it's probably not surprising that, you know, for the price, there's a lot of rice in it. That last bite was mainly rice and tortilla. Kind of bland. Kind of, I'm not, I'm not a, it wasn't great. But, uh, like I said, for overall, for a dollar, I don't really see how you can go wrong. Uh, well, I'm going to go ahead and conclude my review. I don't have anything really more to say about it. Just, uh, Take care of yourself out there and uh, have a good one and I'll talk to you later.